athletes across the country in Colorado have been taking a stand for Jacob Blake. Romy Bean live tonight and on more of what our athletes are doing. Romy? Yeah, Karen, this movement has started with the NBA. They've really been leading the way, but every other league has quickly picked up on it. Now, the NBA is on their third day of boycotting games. The playoffs will resume tomorrow. The Nuggets are scheduled to play Sunday. As for the Denver Broncos, well, they sat out of yesterday's practice and instead spent the day inside creating action plans and ways to create change. The team returned to the field today, but with heavy hearts, the shooting of Jacob Blake hits close to home for Broncos running back. Melvin Gordon because Kenosha, Wisconsin is where he grew up and he says it's where a lot of his family still lives. Gordon said it's scary to know that his friends and family don't feel safe in a community that he once considered very safe. Just try to sit back and understand and, and just look at it as if you know that was you know your, your brother or your husband or your whatever being shot in the back or being shot in the middle of the street. Or being or having his you know throat stepped on um you know just try to look at it from that point just try to understand and educate yourself coming up in sports we've got more from melvin gordon and his teammate justin simmons talking about the difference of fans loving them on the field and off the field pretty interesting stuff all right Robbie, thank you and